Hello everybody and welcome to the official Keepercraft server with me, Wizard. And Keepercraft, if you don't know, uh, it's Minecraft and the word Zookeeper, uh, Keepercraft. Keepercraft is a modded community-based zoo server. Um, Leanna was Leanna is still on. She's working on a build she's doing in Spawn. Today's video is just going to be a quick spawn tour. Uh, it's not going to be a home or a base tour because 90% of my base is unfinished. Uh, next video, maybe we'll do that. Maybe we'll do some other things. If you're interested in joining us on the Keepercraft server, uh, I'll leave links in the Discord. You have to join the Discord and get to know all of uh, all of the a active keepers and um, keepers have to vote you in so without further ado it's just a quick peek around spawn so we'll go this way around spawn and I'll talk to you about the different buildings here this is the pet shop and um, some of the people are going to do quests the ones that just say hello uh, player name you know, hello wizard uh, they're the ones that are gonna going to have quests, but don't have quests yet. Um, some of a lot of the ones have uh, shops that you can do. Uh, we're just using iron coins for mine coins. So that is the pet shop. You can buy all kinds of different things in there: goldfish, cats, dogs. Uh, to come over here, this here. Is Gamer K's storage uh, facility? You can quote unquote rent uh, storage units. Uh, I believe you have to push a bu push a button somewhere here to get one of the keys. So uh, yeah, and I believe there's four storage units. Okay, that's that. The Avian Research Center. This is the first building I built on the server. Vesta Sam, Sam, she built the sign that looks freaking amazing. I love this sign. It's very simple and classy, but it's just, it's very cool. I love it. Uh, in here, as you can see, there's a bunch of birds. Uh, I think one of my favorite mobs is the barn owls. They are just adorable. I had an owl when I was younger, a barn owl. Uh, I had it for three or four years. Uh, I used to live in this uh, one town uh, that's about 50 miles away from where I live now. And I, I lived there with my grandmother. And it was an old farmhouse with a huge barn. Uh, the barn caught on fire and was, um, what do they call it? condemned had to be torn down so when it was torn down this is going to be another quest giver in time uh, when it was torn down you know I was going through it to see if I could salvage anything and stuff like that uh, another shop sells all kinds of bird related stuff uh, like I said I was going through it to see if there was anything I could find in it that I could salvage and I heard these noises uh, there was like a cheeping, chirping, screeching noise. There's Leah. Looks great so far. And uh, yeah, like I said, I heard these chirping, tweeting noises and stuff. And so I kept looking, and I found a nest of birds. Uh, at the mo at the time, I was like 16, 14, 15, 16, somewhere around there. Had no idea what said birds were. So I uh, scooped them up, tried to save them. There was like three of them. Um, they were basically abandoned. They, they had been there for days. They were like starving. This is the fishing shop, bait and tackle. 
Uh, Willie that I stole the name from Stardew Valley has another shop. And Doc. Anyway, like I said, there's a couple three chicks. There's like three. And uh, tried to save them. Well, at first I waited. You know, I waited a couple days to see if the mother would return. I was watching. And the mother never came back, so I tried to save them. Fed them with like an eyedropper. Like mashed up worms and things like that. Uh, this is the koi pond I built. I built the fishing shack. Um, I built the cup of cafe. Which has a couple shops. You can sell stuff and buy food. Over here this shop deals with tea. And tea related things. You can buy and sell stuff here. And uh, like I said I tried to save them. A couple of them died. Like two of them died. One lived. And the one that lived I named Archimedes. I just watched the movie Sword in the Stone and I thought it was a cool name for an owl because the owl on that movie is named Archimedes. And uh, yeah, he lived. Uh, I basically raised him for three or four years and finally I released him into the wild, uh, i.e. he flew away and didn't come back. So I released him into the wild. Um, but it was it was cool while I had him. He was awesome. But yeah, this is a rest area for the koi pond, the bridge. You can see some koi swimming around and things like that. This is the player shopping district. You can come here and rent a shop to sell the stuff that you want to sell and things like that. And there's zombies and stuff, so that is that. I'll try to get away from the zombie here. Uh, come across here. Okay, we've seen that entire side of spawn. Now there's only a couple things here. Uh, this guy in here is going to be a shop. I, ha I have no idea what, what he's going to sell and stuff because I try to make the shops related to the build. So we're going to sleep. So hopefully get away from zombies and stuff. These, these shutters are very cool. They actually function. Uh, spawn is still kind of dangerous. So we're going to get away from that. And this is the post office. With a working shop as well. You can buy and sell different things in here. And stuff of that nature and that is pretty much spawn so that is that so but yeah like I said if you want to join Keepercraft the anybody anybody and everybody is free to join the Keepercraft community but in order to get onto the server to play with us you have to get to know the founders the founders have to vote you in um, it's a community based thing so there's obviously no griefing and things like that but if you're interested I will give information on how to join the discord and you can start getting to know us we can start getting to know you and we can start building awesome zoos together so until then guys, I hope you enjoyed the tour of Spawn as it is so far. Um, next video maybe we'll do a base tour. Uh, there's no zoos built yet on the server that I'm aware of. It's been up for about a month. So until then guys, I hope to see you, talk with you, get to know you, and we will see you in the next video. Have a good one. Bye bye.